Hello, and uh, thank you for uh, joining me once again in my channel. This morning, I was out early buying some uh, uh, flowers from the uh, wholesale because my uh, uh, supply of flowers for the weekend is kind of running low. And um, I have some orders to do, so I needed to buy some extra flowers to fill those orders up. And so that is what I was uh, uh, going to share with you today. I want to show you what I bought. Uh, I was able to get some interesting flowers and I wasn't really expecting it because being a weekend, usually uh, even the wholesale don't have much to sell. But today I was surprised to find um, flowers such as ranunculus. These are uh, import from Italy uh, and these varieties I believe are called Clooney. Aren't they beautiful with that very, very soft pink colors to them? Their cousins over here are anemones. Uh, these guys are grown in um, Ecuador. And I love that dark center in the middle of the bloom. Right beside them is the uh, uh, fragrant stalk, or sometimes are called Mathiola. They have that clovey smell to them. I love using them in my arrangements. Um, and also uh, these roses from uh, California. These are California spray roses, and they have that uh, very soft um, champagne colors to them. And over here, I would like to uh, show you these fragrant freesias, which are normally grown here in BC, but these guys were flown in from Ontario. They're still Canadians, but uh, they were grown in the eastern part of our country. Um, and these guys are um, Dusty Millers. I love using Dusty Millers because they soften anything that I uh, put together. If I have some um, uh, dark colored flowers in my arrangement, if I add Dusty Miller, they soften it right away. Uh, over here are uh, yellow orange roses, which are also from South America. These are from Ecuador as well. And these varieties are called Tycoon. Right above them are the beautiful um, mauve, purpley mauve roses called Amnesia. Aren't they gorgeous? They have that very unique uh, hue to them. And right beside them are the uh, favorite of brides when it comes to making bridal bouquets. These are David Austin roses and they have that very gentle smell to them. It's a beautiful rose smell and it's called Patience. These are Patience David Austin roses. Right over here are one of the greens that we always use in our arrangements. Those are uh, dollar eucalyptus. So these are the flowers that I bought this morning, in addition to what I already uh, have uh, as what you saw in the arrangements that we um, did the other day, the ones that we featured earlier. So these are what I'm going to use in my next arrangement. So stay tuned for that. We'll be making some arrangements today and uh, uh, hopefully you will follow us once again in uh, our next videos. Thank you very much for watching and hope to see you soon. Bye.